Chelsea and Liverpool. And I must say, very agreeable conditions here at the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It is Manchester City taking on Liverpool. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. A match that should be chock full of talking points. Liverpool get it going. Thiago. It's with Fabinho. It did look on for them, but not to be. Gundogan. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Well, it looked so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. On the offensive. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. That's how it looked, but full credit to him for atoning for the error. And he's broken free. Surely. Brilliantly blocked. Foden the ball with Rodri well pass after pass maybe they can chisel an opportunity Nunez Salah well they stopped them in their tracks Foden this looks threatening. De Bruyne. Oh, surely! And a goal to open the scoring. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. Well, Liverpool restart the game. A wake-up call for them, perhaps. Thiago. Chance to do damage. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Gundogan. Grealish. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. The back underway with the lead standing at 2-0.
has the strength to hang on to it. Andrew Robertson. Elliot. And it's still on for him. And the flag does go up. Must have been tight. De Bruyne, now Holland, Foden, the attack continues, they're making considerable progress, and the keeper in position to grab hold of it, Phil Foden, and teammates around him, Gundogan, can they convert? And it goes! Well, it's one goal after another. A highly impressive performance. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Continues then, and it's been all City. Gakpo. Here's Robertson. A danger here as he runs at them. Thiago. Celebrating. Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. And that is going to be all for the first 45 then here at the Etihad Stadium. Well, all in all, a struggle for Mohamed Salah to make his presence felt today, Stuart. Well, Derek, he has to impose himself on this game. He's been far too quiet so far. If they are to get back into this, he needs to make something happen and start getting some shots away. And off and running again, it really was spellbinding what we saw from City in the first half. So let's see how the second 45 plays out. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Gakpo. He continues his run. But they dealt with the threat first. Could pull one back here. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. Gundogan. Erling Haaland. Darwin Nunez. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. And he takes it on and diving to thwart him. Substitution for Manchester City. Coming off the pitch, number eight, Elkai Dundawai. To be replaced by number 
number 20, Bernardo Silva. And deciding to go short with this one. Mo Salah, well, he loves to do this. Cut in off the flank. Can he open the door to a potential goal? Well, there you can see City haven't been able to control possession, but what they've done with it has been really good. And they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. They love to play on the counter-attack. And the threat on the counter-attack is very real. Here they come again. Holland. And still trying to get the shot off. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Virgil van Dijk. 20 minutes to go in this one. Happy birthday to Sasha Walker, celebrating Salah. Encouraging move from Liverpool. A chance to eat into their lead. And still looking to get the shot off. Well, flinging himself at it. But he's gone short with it. Fabinho. And cleared away. Walker. Mares. De Bruyne now. Dias. Walker now. De Bruyne. And return to Mares. Very quick thinking there. Ten minutes to go then. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Could reduce the deficit. And top notch as well as brave goalkeeping. Well, he comes off his line at just the right time. He read that brilliantly. Rodri. Holland. Could be. Saved, but still a chance. He's trying to create something. But the danger averted for now. Thiago. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Can he take advantage? Tenacious tackling. Excellent defending there. Real chance. In it goes! It looked as though they were down and out. Not a bit of it. What will happen next? Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. And so the referee blows the whistle. It is the end of the contest, and the three points go to Manchester City. Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes, and they fully deserved their victory today.